Welcome back to SpongeBob. Uh, Welcome back he, to SpongeBob. He, he, I overwrote Tony again. He overwrote me. I over I overwrote your next time with uh, with your uh, this time with my this time. Because I fucking hate you. Where the where the fuck is this Vine or video? There's there's a bunch of them. Just look up Rin Senpai on Vine. Pardon? That's the person's name. Rin? Okay. Oh, there's some video. Pardon me? Yeah, it's a dude that cross-dresses as a cute girl. And makes people mad intentionally because of it. And he loves it. Mm. He's like, yeah, this is what I get off to. I can't blame him. If I had that sort of power, I'd do the same exact thing. <laughs> I mean, he kills it. He does. I found that video. Oh my fucking god. Great, right? Oh my god! I would be too afraid that I'd break my 3DS. Ugh. Just sneak up on him real slowly. Real quiet life. They're fucking dead. Uh, I, I'm sorry, I just kind of got caught up in this video. Anyway, welcome back to SpongeBob. Is this the next episode? Yeah, this, okay. is, this has been the next episode for the last like five minutes. Sick man, welcome back. Look at this retard. Who? Fuck you. Uh, that looks like Medi. <laughs> it does. It doesn't at all. I mean, it's tall and lanky. He has. He he can handstand. When he one, two, three, two. This Kong. And make everyone mad! Just for you! <laughs> Did you know that Medi hates literally everything? Good. That's why me and him get along so well. That's why he's your best friend. Yep. He hates you. But I know he does. He doesn't actually hate you. He probably but he does. Should. He should. Mm. What the fuck am I goddamn doing right now? So Carl, tell me about fucking uh, this Digimon game. Cyber Sleuth? I did the, tell me about the Digimon game. Digimon Story Cyber Sleuth. Tell me about the Digimon game. It's really fucking good. Tell me about it. What do you want to know about it? The I'll, plot? The. Uh, tell me about the plot. The plot tell is that you're a kid that. and they're a Digimon. That that's. You're doing this probably fucking wrong, by the way. I don't know if you're actually just being retarded on purpose. I'm, I'm actually just being retarded because I'm barely paying attention to the game. Okay. I'm just letting you know that you can't get up there like that. Listen, Tony. It's called speedrunning. I don't know if you've ever fucking heard of it. This is esports. This is the experience. This is Tony Hawk's experience. He lived and died by this experience, Tony. Are you going to fucking let that go? He's going to die someday. I'm surprised he isn't dead already! Uh, me too. It's so fucking... The game is about you being a kid in Japan. And then, like, there's this online world. Like, uh, you ever seen, uh, Dot Hack? Yes. There's, like, a digital frontier that humans created that people can just, like, log a consciousness into, and then they go there. That's called Eden. And, uh, fucking what was it? In Eden, there's these things that, like, started appearing called Eaters. Which just started fucking killing people. Like, their digital consciousness. And in doing so, would suck out their real consciousness and leave them in a comatose state. Tell me more. And then people found out that there are Digimon, which they thought were just, like, programs people created. 
but they actually are not. What the fuck are you doing? Are you getting high while listening to music? Do you not recognize this song? No, I don't. It's the elevator music. I was... You were like halfway through that discussion, I'm like, I'm not even really paying attention to what's going on. So I'm just gonna play <laughs> elevator music. Fuck you. Hey man. I, I do it, I do it to entertain. You do, that's true. So anyway, about Digimon. One of them looks like the squirrel. It's my favorite one. Yeah. Cause it's fucking FUCK! So Carl. Yeah? Tell me about Digimon. Well you see. What is Firewatch? Firewatch is a video game where there's a fire and you have to be careful of it. Thank you. You're welcome. Mm. I, li I like video games. Video Some games are real good. Sometimes. Like, I really like Metal Gear Solid V and Skyward Sword. And I fucking loathe this goddamn game. You love this game. Uh, You're the one who wanted me to do this fucking game from the very beginning. You're right. And I know you're right. But I should also advise you that... Um... Do you not work on the world's logic? Hmm? What's do that? Do you not do what the Lord do? Hello? Do as I say, not as I do, Tony. Do do. Please don't uh, shit on the microphone, Tony. I don't fool. I'm redegraded to this level already. Yep. At least it wasn't like the first episode. <laughs> you just said the first one was the best one we did. Yeah, 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 it was. It was. It was. It was. Yeah. It absolutely was. Hey, Carl. Yeah? How's, how's it make you feel that uh, eventually I'm going to drive up to New York? And, oh, pretty good. And before I actually, like, visit, I'm just going to bring all my amiibo with me, and... I'm going to steal them all. I will actually kill you. <laughs> you could pay me for this Greninja that you said you wanted, like, however long ago. You still even want it. Do you not want Greninja? I mean, I always debate it because he's like the best made one I have. You haven't taken him out of the box yet, have you? No, I have. Oh, you have? Okay, I was going to say, you're, like, you're fucking crazy. I was debating on selling him in the box because I know the collectors would have like shit themselves over that. Huh, it's almost like you're part of the problem. I know. It's almost. I don't even know why I bought a Greninja. Because Greninja's fucking cool, man. <clears throat> I just saw it on sale at Toys R Us at like 12 in the morning. And I was like, hell yes! I'm gonna buy this so someone else can't. <laughs> I, I, I did that with Lucario. I know you did, you fucking stoner. The last one. I guess I'm surfboarding now. Eat your heart out, Twilight Princess and Final Fantasy eat, 7. Eat your heart out, Tony Hawk. Carl. You can't do it as good as this. Carl. What's up? We should play, uh, Twilight Princess instead. Never. Why? Because I don't like Twilight Princess. I know you don't. But you also don't like this game. That's, that's a very fair point. I've never actually played Twilight Princess. So here's the thing. Do you think, like, bad games... Exist? Uh, yes. Well, well, no, not... I don't know how to phrase this. But like obviously like this game is bad. But like do you th huh? It's not bad. It's it's a four point five out of ten. I would say it's a uh a six point eight. Just because the controls aren't like the worst things in the world. But it's nowhere near like a great game. Okay, so let me change this argument then. Game like Duck Dynasty. Yeah. That game is made by Activision. That game yeah. is based off a TV show where a bunch of racist people get together and make duck calls. They made a video game out of it. 
Do you think that game is... Okay, fuck, I don't know how to phrase this. Do you think it's obvious when even AAA games are bad? Uh, no. As the same way that it is for, like, smaller, low-budget games? Probably not, no. You don't think so? I don't really know how to phrase this in a way that... Also, oh. you, you just totally ate shit, by the way. I you, completely you, ate shit. You could have made really that. I'm really mad about it. But you don't think it can be as obvious that a AAA game is bad? I mean, as a let's game, put it this way. As a game, A like, lot of people, when Metal Gear Solid V came out, said that it was like a masterpiece and everyone loved it and there was nothing wrong with it. And then like a couple months after it came out, people started going, No, this game's pretty flawed. It's pretty not great. So, there's that. Well, I know, but that's also the point where I'm making, is... Do you think we've reached a point now where... No one trusts game reviews and no one trusts, you know, E3 shit? Like, today, uh... Yu Suzuki posted Shenmue 3 screenshots. And the game looks absolutely beautiful. But if you fucking believe that that game was gonna look like that when that comes out, you're fucking stupid. You're a fucking idiot. Carl, uh, edit pictures of Shenmue 3. I will. Boom. Bam. There's one. There's another one. There's another one. That game is not going to look like that in launch. Because God forbid game developers wait a year before saying they're going to make something. Like Mighty Number no. 9. Hey, Mighty Number no. 9 delayed again. Yep. Back at it again at Mighty Number 9. God, could you imagine if this video comes out and Mighty Number 9 is delayed again? I'd probably kill KG and open A4 everybody. Mighty Number 9. Let's see what's going on with Mighty Number 9. I'm supposed to go that way. Carl, we should really have a podcast. We should. We should finally start one with fucking Medi to sit there and say nothing. Yeah. Or we can get Dan on it too, because Dan will actually talk. I like Dan. Dan's a good man. Dan the man. Dan knows what he's talking about sometimes. Dan. Dan's a good guy. Until he sits down and says that Chie Satanaka is the best ga girl in all of video gaming, because he's a fucking Chie Satanaka loving piece of shit! I said that once to him and he lost his fucking mind. He thought it was hysterical. Speaking of hysterical. Hey, look, it's Sparky. What about Sparky? He's right there. Look at that piece of shit. He sure does dance like Sparky does, so I can give him that. Hmm. That. Oh, you died? Oh. Well, that was awesome. Next time on Game Grumps. Next time on Angry Gamers. SpongeBob continues to be the biggest piece of shit video game in the history of the world. And the worst television show on fucking recorded history.